land uh, news from the land of fruits and nuts out here in California. Um, <clears throat> this was in the KTLA newsletter that came out yesterday. Uh, California has launched a mortgage relief program to help homeowners. Uh, basically what they've done, the state of California grabbed a bunch of money that was available uh, for COVID relief and is going to pay, pay down not necessarily pay off, but in some cases pay off mortgages of some homeowners who got affected by COVID. They can help about 40,000 people in the state of California who fell behind on housing payments during the COVID-19 pandemic. Um, eligible households can qualify for a one-time grant of up to $80,000 for any of their past due housing related bills. Uh, the, the only catch is that, and this is kind of smart, uh, state of California said they're only going to send checks directly to the vendors. They're not going to send checks uh, to the people. So it'll go right to Bank of America, Wells Fargo, uh, the PG&E, Pacific Gas and Electric, and, and folks like that. So, uh, you know, that's kind of good news. There's a billion dollars in this fund. Uh, and it came, once again, from the Federal American Rescue Plan that passed uh, earlier this year in March. So uh, we were the first state to get our program approved by the U.S. Department of Treasury. Evidently, there are other states that are looking to do that. Now, how's this going to affect you guys? Um, if you're looking to buy foreclosures and these people can qualify for these types of grants, you're not going to be able to buy them because they're going to get free money from the state of California and shortly from other states. We're just ahead of the curve because... Um, you know, we've gotten to the front of the line with the Treasury Department on this stuff. But I guess there are other states that are going to be doing something similar. Don't expect this in places like Texas and Florida, but maybe the state of New York, Illinois, uh, and some of those states uh, may have a program similar to this being approved pretty shortly. So uh, keep your eyes on the news because this can, these are the kinds of things that can dramatically affect the market. Now, Keep in mind, people have to qualify for this. I'm not sure exactly what all the requirements are, but it is tied to you being able to prove that you had a loss because of COVID-19, uh, which in the past, the U.S. government has been okay with just signing a piece of paper saying, yeah, it affected me. You didn't have to describe it. You didn't have to prove it. You just had to say it affected you. So we'll see what happens. But, you know, this could eat into the... Um, um, the foreclosure market that we expect is coming is, is actually here right now. Um, the pre-default and then the default and, and pre-foreclosure markets and then again the auctions at the end. So this could have an effect. Although it's only going to help evidently 40,000 uh, homeowners in California. That's small compared to the number of homeowners we have. You know, it's still every little bit eats away, eats into the pool uh, of what you guys can do. So Keep you apprised if we hear where this is coming up in other states, but it's something to look forward to.